Hello guys, welcome back to the second part of the Metro Exodus. Back in action. We are at a crossroads, so to speak, where everybody can help but wonder. What next? Where do we go from here? Hmm, yes. More or less what I expected from you. But you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked it? Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stepan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. So, they were telling the truth. Who was telling the truth? Why won't you answer? Who were those people trying to kill us? Why would they shoot at you, the Order's commander? Explain something, at least! You owe us that! Well, I might as well drop the bomb now. The war did not end. What do you mean, uh, did not end? Let me finish. Most of our cities are destroyed. The rest of the country is probably under enemy occupation. To avoid new nuclear attacks against us, Command chose the only viable course of action. To play dead. To ensure radio silence, the shield system was created. A network of radio jammers covering Moscow and suburbs. So that some radio enthusiasts wouldn't bring more bombs down on our heads by whining on air. And it's one of these jammers that got disabled by the hands of those present here. Could you not have shared that before? Say, uh, before Artyom took that radio outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half a year ago. Under a strict, you talk, you die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all due respect, if we can't go back, maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Uh... Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, check the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. Look for transmissions from the Ark. <sighs> Do you understand now why we are traitors in the eyes of command? We shut down a jamming station, shot up the guards, destroyed a patrol train, and ran away from Moscow. Who even needs a trial when the case is so clear? There's no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command, what are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an old legend. Not at all. Wait a moment, what was that? Listen, everyone! Dash five. I repeat. Proceed to the rally point. Rally point location is code one eight one one right. dash seven nine. Area Where was that number eight, supposed to be? Five. Only by standing together shall we overcome so it any is and somewhere all obstacles. around here. The Yamantal Mountain. So the route from here should go uh, like this. This is our goal. So, is this what you had in mind? Yes! This is it! The Ark Project is a whole city underground. Enormous stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. They have already started the restoration work. We will tell them that Moscow is alive. It wasn't all for nothing. Everything will change. Everything. Do you get it? A new life is starting for all the survivors of the world. Yay! By the way, are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction. So I think the moment calls for... <clears throat> Bring it out to me. Bring what out, Colonel? Sir? That thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. <laughs> Do you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, uh, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a short trip to the Urals, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. Well, let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, eh? It's about time. Let's go or Anna and be done with it. <laughs> nah, go to hell. <laughs> Even better. Oh, come How on. about Aurora, the Roman goddess of dawn and a cruiser of, uh, uh, you know what? 
That's better. <laughs> Not bad. I like it. Ah, beautiful name. Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's treat you to Aurora. Hey, Artyom, let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. You're back. Full steam ahead. Hi. Uh, Full oh steam God. ahead. Wow, that's some distance. I wonder how long it will take. How are you, Alyosha? After all those years in the underground, the air of the surface seemed incredibly fresh, intoxicating. But that was not what had caused the crew's euphoria. Our journey finally got a definite purpose provided by the transmission from the government bunker in the Urals. For 20 years, we thought that neither the government nor military high command had survived. Turns out they're still around. Where were they? while we were eating each other alive in the metro. We'll have a lot of questions for them once we reach Yamantau, if we reach it. The ruins of our country are under enemy control, according to Miller, and we'll have to fight through to our goal. A small team against the occupation armies? What are the chances that we'll succeed, that we'll get some answers? Anything off yet, darling? <laughs> Here, let's warm you up a little bit. So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life. The life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the bridge! Shots fired! Four bogies on a trolley! Someone's roadblock. Who was it? Any uniforms? None. They were wearing rags. Just some old farts. Old farts, huh? That's just the perimeter guard. They could have put anyone there, even women and children. Do you really think we found them, Colonel? Well, we can't be sure. I was expecting to run into them much earlier. The trolley is headed towards the bridge. Some fortifications there. This looks peaceful. A village and a church on the water. We need intel. Here, Artyom. I put a mark on your map. Get there and find out what you can about that bridge. Taking a prisoner would be ideal. Anna, you cover him. Yes, sir. May I go with Artyom too? As backup? No. Until we figure out our situation, you are not to take a step away from the Aurora. These two can handle themselves just fine. Yermak! When can you get the Aurora running again? I don't know yet. I'm gonna check on that cylinder, but a full day at least. I see. Let's go, Artyom. Get to it then. Spartans, let's prepare the Aurora for defense. Artyom, don't forget your backpack. It's a new model. A portable workshop, so to speak. The manual is inside. 
It doesn't come with crafting materials, though, so keep an eye out for Thank those. Thank you. Let's move out, Artyom. Just be careful out there. The new Metro sure Exodus game starts say, now. There's one flimsy roadblock. And those guys, well, they didn't look like army men at all. Just old men. Most of the country has been destroyed or occupied. Even those who speak our language might be enemies by conviction or out of fear. Oops. Do you hear the bell? We must have given them a good scare. They served the enemy, enslaved or something. Going down. <laughs> that was great. Hey, what was that? Could you check it out? Another jump scare? We don't need flashlight here. Yeah, looks like we have to craft something. I'm opening my backpack. Let's see. Oh, I really like this revolver. Oh no, I accidentally. Yeah, anyway, we will craft things later. Um, clear. Absolutely clear. I took a look around while you were inside. That electric tower there looks like a perfect sniping position. Let's go. Roger, Roger. Let's do this. Come on, woman. Walk faster. Okay, Artyom, I'll climb up there while you take the boat to the church. Furthest distance is blurred. I'll call you when I'm settled. Look at that, what the fuck is that? That's something huge there. Oh. Are they coming here? Anyway. Okay. Let's go. And these guys are probably some savages. Praise the Lord. Father Salantius has already started his sermon. Just enter the temple and see the light of truth. We are a peaceful lot. The Lord is merciful, but he has of electricity and other sinful lures of the enemy that to those who falter he grants salvation oh, brothers! your all evils can dance in anyone they killed my friends and my daddy Satan's spawn <laughs> Stay calm, brothers and sisters. The heretic is trapped. For so will the Lord. Soon our brothers militant will be here. Come on! Mama, it's him! The man from the train! He's here to save us! I can't believe this! I had all but lost hope! We're not from here either! Silantius like locked us up here a year her. ago! Yes, the bridge dwellers won't even talk to heretics. But I'll tell you everything I've seen Our in this place all that year! Under the cover of fog. Oh, it's the bridge guard! Silantius fooled them just like the locals, but unlike them, the bridge guard have guns! Run! There's a way out down here and there's a boat at the dock! 
We also have <laughs> one, but it's too small for all of us. Our tomb strike, get to the boat. We will rescue her, later. don't worry. That's some Skyrim dying physics. It's like, ooh, and they just ragdolling. Oh, 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 oh! Oh, brother! I'm back. Evil shrimps. Some big fish. Oh, God. Of You're NATO alive. Occupation. <laughs> Impressive <laughs> after the horrors Duke told us about. But there is one more question I need to ask. But of course, Sorry, I don't quite get what you. So, you've never seen any foreign army in this area? No, I haven't seen any army. But we haven't really been to any important places. I see. Hmm. Artyom, a moment. Thank you, Artyom. If not for you, we'd never have escaped that place. They were so busy Artyom, stop by my desk once you're done talking to the old man. Great job saving them, Artyom. Katya here has provided us with vital information. A mechanic called Crest is hiding in the port. His help is required if we're to fix the Aurora in the foreseeable future. Yeramak can't handle the repairs alone. So, once you're ready, go to the port and invite Crest to join us. And then get back ASAP. We'll have to decide what to do about the fanatics on that bridge. Now we know for sure that the bridge is in working order. They crossed it last year when they got here. 
Well, at least some things are clearer now. But still, so many questions. <sighs> there might not even be any enemy forces around here at all. They probably Damn. get us from the key regions what only. What do I even do about this? I could replace the cylinder, but it's just no spare. Hi, Artyom. Oh, go. Hey, 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 hey. Punch it, Artyom. Okay. I hear lots of weird sounds. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of low on ammunition. I guess that is bad. Oh. Shit, lots of them, lots of them, lots of them, what? Oh, they're climbing! Oh god, oh god, oh god, help! Um, hello? Come up here! 
I'm good. Thank you. Thank you, sir. You pretty amazing, Bratuha. That was crazy. Blin. Those mutants are pretty hardcore. The villagers I never have a chance against them. You you just cut through them, Blin. Well, it's pleasure to meet you. Name's Christ, by the way. Are you from the train? Bet the locals wouldn't even talk to you guys. <laughs> Open fire right away, didn't they? <laughs> of course, those dumb bastards. I've been here long enough to know the drill. They have a cult over there, the dumbasses are hung up on technology having destroyed the old world. So they don't exactly take kindly to smart guys here. And me, well, they were just gonna lock me up until I agreed to go fight those electrical demons of theirs to absolve my sins. Because I was in cahoots with Satan, apparently, blad. <laughs> Some Satanist I am. <laughs> I've been fixing engines and trading all my life. Now, now I'm moving to the east. Blin, I'm sick of this part of country. There's just nothing to do here anymore. The cities are gone. Bandits, beasts all around. Lots of space across the Volga, though. Plenty of opportunity. So, I came here with my rail car full of trading goods, hoping to make a few sales on the way east. What a fool I was. I was lucky to get out alive. <laughs> anyway, since you've arrived, I've been thinking of this little plan I had, never had a chance to pull off alone, but since you guys are also going east... Now, judging by what I could see with my binoculars, it's a miracle your engine is still running. Oh, by the way, take the binoculars. I'll show you where everything is. Look at the bridge first. See that section on top? It should lower if the emergency mechanism still works. Katya from the church should know better. I've never been to the bridge myself. There, to the right, that huge hangar. That's a terminal, Blit. The cult is considered a holy place. Covered it all in graffiti, schmafiti, their tsarfish live there, you know? Stupid bastards. Even further right, see the building near all those carriages? Used to be a train depot. There are some bandits there now, but the place itself ain't bad. Oh, the area nearby isn't too bad either. There's a good hunting and stuff. I set up several safe camps around there. If you find them, you could rest, fix your equipment. <laughs> Unless you prefer spending nights at an open campfire. Now, come on, let me show you my home now. Okay, let's sleep. To buy some smokes from the villagers before the assholes chase me away. Damn creatures didn't like my life, huh?
shit! Oh. Electricity is chasing me. What the hell is that thing? Hello, doggy. Um. Yep, I have to pass here. But I don't want any trouble, so I'm just gonna pass you. Really silently. Really, really silently. Up, babe. Artyom, I heard you call me. It was so great there. <coughs> but I heard you and couldn't leave you. <coughs> Spider, get out! Let's squeeze in here. Oh, someone is here. Can I silently take it out, maybe? Okay. Yeah, these guys are kind of scary, but not that much scary. Die. Die. Yeah. to do oh Artyom, 
Hold on, we're coming for you. Ha, Anna! What's wrong? Anna! Oh, God damn it. We have to tell the others that we found you, Sam. Guys! <coughs> it's good I can't found me. Oh, what is this place? See the barrels? They're chemicals. This place is either for storage or it's a dump. And that short could have been put there by the locals to mark the spot. Thank you, my love. Oh, okay. All right. So, uh, Arjun, let's pick her up now? No way in hell. I can... I can walk just fine. I'll just rest a bit and get going. <laughs> the old man's probably going seven sorts of crazy now, thinking his precious daughter got hurt or something. <clears throat> Dad, it's me. My radio battery died. I got it wet. Other than that, I'm fine. Artyom and the guys are here. Persuade my father about letting Katya and Nastya travel with us. Artyom, help us here. The old man won't let Katya and Nastya come with us. I. Uh, we. We have to go back now, I guess. Where would you go? The phonetics will. Hi, Artyom. Well, Alright, welcome to the crew. Thank you. Won't let you down. Hey, Artyom, see how it all worked out? Come here, Artyom. Have a seat. Look, we have an opportunity to cross the bridge without an assault. There are trade caravans going up the river, and the bridge dwellers do business with them. So, disguised as such traders, we will infiltrate the bridge and lower it. Katya says it still works. They won't be able to stop us if we move fast. And should they try, we'll cross it no matter what those fanatics think. They want blood, they will get it. So now, we only have to wait for the traitor's boat. Colonel, sir, we can't just leave them here. They will be eaten Sipan, alive. Sipan, did you ever try using your head? Do you know where we are going? What we are going to face on the way there? Where, pray tell, are they going to sleep on the Aurora? Atop the coal crates? We Spartans can handle it. But for a woman, with a six-year-old daughter, no less, this is unacceptable. I'll give them my bedroll and move into the stock. You will fall asleep and get your throat cut the next day you'll get guard duty after trying to sleep there. Still, I, I know we can't leave them. Let's just collect that carriage Katya told us about while we wait. We can't leave the child here. And anyhow, how long are we going to sleep in turns for? Are you starting that again? How? How are we going to collect that carriage? I'm not taking the Aurora there. Oh, you don't need it. I have a rail car hidden in the terminal. It can tow a carriage like nobody's business. Artyom and I can go get it and, and bring the carriage back. No way I'm letting you go. It will take us both till morning to finish the repairs, and I can't handle it myself in time. Okay, okay, have it your way. I'm done playing the monster here. We get that carriage. We take the civilians with us. Artyom, will you handle this? Yep. Listen, Artyom. If the caravan is sighted, drop everything and rush to the port. It's our best chance of traversing the bridge. Thanks, Dad. Katya and Nastya will be so grateful. Here, Artyom. It's a breaker for the rail car. It won't run without this. She's a real babe, Artyomich. No two ways about it. We went to hell and back, her and I. So much stuff you hold, so... Many tight spots she saved me from. 
Look, Artyom, since you're going to the terminal, hear me out. It's quite a distance away, and look, if you go at night, there's less of a chance you might run into bandits. They stay at their camps when it's dark. But it's not gonna be easy either, since more beasts come out, and they're also electrical anomalies. The fanatics call them the demons of electricity, so you should think about your options before heading out. Artyom, Duke is on a mission in that area. He's keeping tabs on the bridge. Reception is bad there. We get mostly static from him. Anyway, if you meet him, he'll update you on the latest developments in the terminal. I bet you've conspired with Anna and Stepan. I care for those two no less than you. But we don't know if what's ahead is any better than the fanatics. I guess we'll have to live and see. Great job persuading the old man. Check out my setup here, Artyom. I finally got everything the way I wanted. A proper workbench, with storage space for all my tools, and some to spare. You can clean your weapons and make ammo for them here, just like with any other workbench you might find. My gun rack is only available here on the Aurora, though. I'll keep samples of every gun you find, and you can exchange them whenever you want. Always in the best working condition. Oiled and shiny like new. <laughs> you won't have to install any attachments again, though. I am going to make you all competent gunsmiths eventually. I have a present for you here. A Tihar rifle. Bring any bells? It's pneumatic. But it still pecks a wallet. Plus, making bullets for it is easy as pie, even in the field. Just remember to keep that pressure up, otherwise you might as well be spitting him out yourself. Other than that, it will never fail you. I did my best. Nice. And don't forget to drop by from time to time. I have a few ideas for improving it. Well, I won't keep you here any longer. Ups. Let's do this. Anna, thank you and Artyom for helping us. I don't oh, know what would have become of us without you. Oh, that's all the way back there. You. Anyway, I'm going. <laughs> Plus, I don't know why, but even though there's jump scares, I'm not that much scared from this game. What the hell is that? Already a monster there? No, that's a sign probably. That's a sign, right? Yep. Okay, we're going to the factory. Let's do this. Okay, so what the hell I'm doing here?
in a shotgun. That's for sure. Let me guess, boss fight is up ahead. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, too many, too many. Yeah. Feel suddenly I got kind of stressed out. God damn.
Wow. Thank you. God, this place is intense, really, really intense. And that will keep screaming. run oh god Out of ammo, literally. I don't know how to combat like uh, knife combat. God damn. So, oh god, oh, I fell down. You know what? I'm just gonna run. Why did I even waste ammunition? These guys are not scary, they're fluffy. Okay. Nothing to be scared of. Yep, that's the way, okay. Thank God. Thank you, whale. You're so helpful. I promise to not to talk. Seriously, I never heard Artem talk. Beside of the loading menu and intro and outro. Hallelujah. We have a night scalp. It's for the most part accumulated in
nothing. Nothing but a little bitch. I'm gonna make cry and beg. He ain't doing a thing, that bitch! <laughs> That's some cliche Russian troll there. Russian troll talk. man Ah, oh, isn't she a beauty? Oh, you can see she's been Come up here. Camp for I have something time. to talk to you about. So I'm like my poor old guy. Hello, Artyom. You're back. 
you did great. Thank you. So, here's the plan. Your group captures the tugboat. Then you, Duke and Crest, take it to the bridge. While Crest distracts the guards, you and Duke infiltrate the control room at the top and lower the bridge. On your mark, we'll ram the gates, pick you up, and... And... I pray to God it works out. Hmm. <clears throat> I can't give you or Duke any direct support. The data we have tells us the enemy's main force is guarding the gate. One more thing, Artyom. Look after Duke, all right? He's a great scout, but uh, prone to unnecessary risks. Now, sure, he's young, but if he continues like that, uh, who knows what will happen. So give him a good example and do it smoothly and quietly. You are his role model, and as such should remember that you are special forces, not tank jocks. Good luck, Artyom. Thank you, man. You just blew my mind! My guitar! No! Shoot! I laid down my weapons already! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! I can pay the, the goods! Take them! You can take the goods! Stay calm! It's us! Artyom, all of our guys are fine. You did great. A shame we couldn't do it quietly. So, you guys ready to set off? Too late if you're not. We have no time to waste. Good luck. 
luck, guys. I hope the winds are fair and the waters are smooth. And Artyom, watch it out there. We're gonna go about halfway there, then wait in the reeds until about 4 o'clock. We want to get there early in the morning. Bye, Anna. Bye. Gonna miss you. I already miss you. Okay, that was nice. That was a really long chapter. Oh boy. Artyomich, Duke. We're on final approach. There. See that fire at the very top? That's the control post. Well, it used to be anyway. Now it's a shrine, Blade. Closer to God at the top, you see? That's where you have to go. I'll distract the guards now. Hey, you are sure? Catch the line! Ready! Hey, sailor! What did you do to your barge? What you gonna sell now? <laughs> Whoa, you're so funny! Jackass, baby. So, Artyom, shall we move? Whoever gets there first we wins. Break a leg. Artyom, Duke, the Aurora is quietly moving into position. We'll be ready to act so on your signals. Roger that, sir. We're on it. Over. One day you are going to get sent to fight demons for that. Oh, but it's so early. Just tell me what he said. It's all in God's hands. That is true. His will be done. You know, I've been thinking, what do those heretics want to do? Ah, they just want to get to the other side, that's all. And what's so nice over there on the other side? Is hey, brother. Everyone is looking for a better life, which is where? Where? Where we are not. Why is that? We are the just ones. We are Father Salentius. It's not what I meant. Boy, you are dumb. And shout if you see any. Go dead. Protect me from illness. Though I would have. 
Here we go. We left Volga behind, 
The endless expanses of Russia stretch before us now. The bridge dwellers had finally decided to believe that we were not demons and let us pass. Anna was right. We invaded their world, and it's not up to us to destroy it. No matter how stupid it may seem. Electricity is a sin. Is that really worse than the lies we were told in the metro? About how the whole world was dead and there was nowhere to go? Everybody in the tunnels bought that convenient lie. Once we reach Yamantau, we will at least know if that lie was justified. Since so far, we haven't met any signs of enemy occupation. Okay, guys. I will see you next part. Peace out.